Assalamualaikum and hello. In this video, we will discuss artificial neural networks. This topic will be divided into several smaller videos and in this video in particular is the introduction. As humans, we use our intelligence to do these things. We use it to make decisions, to communicate, to identify patterns in data, to remember what people have said and to adapt to new situations. Machines can imitate human intelligence and they are also able to accomplish this task. Machines use artificial intelligence to provide more accurate results, to interact with humans using natural language, to learn from their mistakes and adapt to new environments, and also to learn from data and automate repetitive learning. In the diagram on artificial intelligence, machine learning, and deep learning, we are currently will be discussing on machine learning, which is systems that learn things without being programmed to do so. Machine learning is a type of adaptive mechanism which enables computer to learn from experience, to learn by example, and to learn by analogy. It is a type of machine with the learning capabilities that can improve its performance over time. And the most popular approaches to machine learning are artificial neural networks and genetic algorithm. Before we delve into ANN, let's talk about the inspiration of this model, the human brain. A neural network can be defined as a model of reasoning based on human brain, and the brain, the biological brain, consists of densely interconnected sets of nerve cells of basic information processing unit called neurons and the human brain incorporates nearly 10 billion neurons and 60 trillion connections or synapses between them. By using multiple neurons simultaneously or at the same time, brain can perform its function much faster than the fastest computers in existence today. Currently, there is no supercomputer in existence that can triumph the human brain. This is an artist's impression of the biological neurons. Biological neuron has a very simple structure. First, soma, which is the cell body, then writes are fibers that accept input from environment, and axon is a single long fiber that sends output to other neurons. Meanwhile, what is artificial neural network? ANN is an information processing paradigm inspired by the way biological nervous systems such as the brain process information and the key element to this paradigm is how um, it process system through the structure of the information processing system. This information processing system is composed of a large number of highly interconnected neurons, neurons that are connected to each other and they are working in unison to solve specific problems. And these neurons, they are connected to each other by weighted links and they pass signals from one neuron to another. Just like humans and ANN learn by example, it is usually configured for a very specific application such as pattern recognition or data classification. And it learns through a learning process. What is the learning process? This learning process just like a biological system where neurons would make adjustment to the synaptic connection that exists between neurons, this is also true of how ANN learn as well. Being inspired by biological brain, an analogy can be made on the components of biological and artificial neural network. For example, a soma can be mapped to a neuron then write can be mapped to input, axon can be mapped to output, while synapse can be mapped to weight in an artificial neural network. This is an example of a typical ANN architecture. It has three layers, an input layer, middle layer, and the output layer. 